Hey guys, what's up? It's Raper001. I know it's been a very long time since I posted our most recent video and I apologize. There's just been a lot of stuff going on, you know, life gets crazy sometimes. But I appreciate all of you who have stuck with me through thick and thin and have remained as my subscribers, friends, etc. I really do appreciate it. I'm, I mean, frankly, without y'all, I would not really go through this whole video thing. So, anywho, enough with my rambling. Um, just a little bit of an update of what I've been up to. Uh, since today is the 75th anniversary of Batman, in case any of y'all haven't heard about it, um, actually, I didn't really remember the anniversary until earlier this morning when my friend Laura told me about it, and um, she wanted to hang out, so we hit up a few comic book stores, and we kind of just went crazy, and they were giving out all kinds of free magazines, posters, etc., um, a few book samples, and a few a couple of like complete books but um, I mainly just went for like the Batman stuff and a couple of posters. Um, Barnes & Noble was also giving away free stuff and it was really cool and you could take your picture with Poison Ivy or at least some chick that was dressed as Poison Ivy. I unfortunately didn't get a chance to take a picture with her only because uh, I got too distracted by a really cool scavenger hunt. Yes I know. but. Um, it actually made us use our brain for once. <laughs> um, I'm pretty sure some younger kids probably did way better than we did, but hey, we did it, and hopefully one of us will be a winner of whatever surprise prize they're giving away for the people that completed the scavenger hunt, which is pretty exciting. I don't know if y'all had that, or y'all are living at, wherever, but yeah, that's pretty much what I did today. And um, actually, let me just share with you a couple of the cool, awesome stuff that I bought, which um, <laughs> which I tried to behave as best I could. Uh, went to a really cool new comic book store that my friend introduced me to, and it's called Collected. And this is a really awesome one that I had to have. The Witcher, I don't know if you can see that so great. Sorry, the lighting in my room is kind of crappy right now only because I don't want to wake up certain people, but yeah, I just thought this was so cool. There was another one in front of it that I wasn't really, really interested in, but I just so happened to like dig behind it, and this just happened to be the only one they had. I just loved the artwork, the fact that it looks just like him with a little scar in his eye, and the artwork was looks really cool too. I don't know if you can see that, but I mean, freaking awesome. Plus, I and pre-ordering The Witcher 3 on Xbox One. Ah, I cannot wait! I don't know if any of y'all are doing that, but, I mean, it looks pretty freaking awesome. So, I mean, yeah, and I'm definitely getting the Collector's Edition in case you've gotten wind of that. Um, I know that the pack comes with a hand-painted um, figurine of Geralt, and he's mounted on top of this, like, really badass looking griffin thing creature. And he's just, like, on there with the sword attacking it. And uh, you can Google this, but I figured if you want to know ahead of time. And it has his, includes a wearable medallion, just like Geralt's. And it also has um, a very large, like, art book. I'm guessing it's going to have all kinds of artwork pertaining to the game. And... It also comes with a steel book. Don't know what exactly that's going to be, but it looks pretty cool anyway. And then it comes with a um, map from the game and some kind of soundtrack. I'm guessing the music and I think some kind of like a uh, cool looking like game manual thing. As f that is the extent of my knowledge. So sorry if I can't really provide any more information on that. Um, so yeah, definitely getting that. Um, and then just one more thing I want to show you that I got today, which it's all your fault, Laura. It's all your fault. <laughs> um, yeah, she just pointed this out before we left the store, and she just casually just like, oh, hey, Yachty, did you see that? And just I looked up and, oh, I mean, it's just it's just and I mean compared to other like graphic novels that I've seen that are based off of the alien franchise 
that are just like a twist on the story have anything to really do with the movies, which I'm not complaining. But this is the first one I've managed to find that is actually based off the first Alien movie. So, I mean, it's, it's exact to the story. I mean, as far as I can see, the characters look just like the original actors and actresses from the movie. I mean, like, for example, this page. Let's see. I mean, that's pretty cool. It's pretty rad. So, I'm really excited. I haven't read it yet. I just got it today. I'm still working on another graphic novel. Um, AVP graphic novel. I'll just go ahead and quickly give you a glance at that. I was, um, Really excited when I found this a few days ago because uh, since you know obviously I'm a big AVP Xbox 360 game buff as we all are so <laughs> I just found this the other day at Madness Comics and it looks just like the picture that's inside the game manual inside the AVP um, game disc case so I thought that was really cool that I found it and I was just like oh my god I was just oh uh, yeah anyway. I'm just slowly starting my collection. It's long overdue, but now I'm gonna be like really broke by the time I get a few books in. But anyway, doesn't matter because I'll enjoy them all. So, and let me just show you a couple more things that um, they were giving away today for free, which is even better. Um, this really cool exclusive Batman comic. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that. So I got that. And then I got um, that they were giving at Barnes & Noble. And then I also got from there this really cool um, Zodiac series banner poster thing. It's really cool. Let me back up a little bit so you can see it. Some of you might already have this. Um, I know my friend Laura does. So, yeah, it's really cool. And then on the back, it's got more stuff about um, each character from the series and what zodiac symbol they are and um, how that describes them. So that thought that was really cool. I just need to find somewhere to hang this in my room because later on I'll give you a tour. But, yeah, I have quite a few things already on my wall. And then also I got this really huge Batman poster, which let me see if I can even show you all. Um... It's just like really huge and big, and it's so really awesome that I got this for free. So yeah, I don't know if you can see that, but pretty cool artwork. I'm gonna have to stand up for this, but I mean, I don't know if you can see it, but it shows like Batman as like the jailer and um, all the villains behind the bars. It's got really cool. I love it. I love it. I don't know where I'm going to put it, though. <laughs> um, and then, I think that's... Oh, and I also took with me a really cool miniature version of that poster. Um, a really cool little bookmark, which I thought it was cute. But anyway, uh, there were other things that they were giving away for free, but I just took what I thought really um, fit my interest. So, yeah. And then, really quickly, I'm trying to not drag time along. Um, at uh, Collected, I got this comic, which is really awesome, Batman, super cool, and at um, Madness, I got this, so based off of Batman Beyond, I was one of the fans of that show, I liked it, so yeah, haters can hate that. <laughs> anyway, so yeah, that was a few of the awesome, cool, free stuff that I got today. Um, let me know if y'all got any cool stuff for the 75th anniversary of Batman. That would be awesome. Just comment below. And, um, well, I guess we can move on to what this video is actually really about, which is prize giveaway, right? I know, long overdue. I've been promising and promising this for a while, and finally it's here. So, and... So this is just like a little intro to the prize giveaways. And so what I have, what you can win is this awesome comic book of Thor, Shattered Heroes. I thought it was awesome. I love the artwork, so I hope you do as much as I do. So here's a little closer look at that. Okay. And then you can also get, you're also going to get a Avengers lanyard 
key ring thing show it to you so if you're big into going into Comic Con or any of those freaking awesome conventions that I don't really get much time to call off or go to y'all can probably wear this and display your awesome cool badges and then you get a awesome really cool pin that I found today at Madness let me say oh wrong sorry sorry wrong yeah Batman and Robin to do a personal commemoration to the 75th anniversary and of course I wouldn't forget you guys I got you a copy your very own copy of the same Batman comic that I grabbed so I just grabbed I went ahead and grabbed an extra one especially for this occasion so and just for kickers you get a Mr. Potato Head pan. How about that? But yeah, I, I'm sorry. I just had a really weird geeky moment there. But your friends that know me, yeah, you know, I'm weird and nerdy that. So if you guys are really wanting to win this prize, just make sure to subscribe to my channel, like this video, because it's awesome, and um, just leave a comment below with the word Batman, however you would like to phrase that, and I will randomly draw a lucky winner, and I will let you know ASAP probably uh, within the next couple days, hopefully within this week. All right, thank you guys for watching, and just to end this with a humorous note, I have a special video, which is actually kind of a throwback on one of my previous videos that I've uploaded on my channel. Um, it's actually a blooper from AVP Dodgeball. Uh, a couple of y'all have probably already seen it already. Um, so I thought uh, y'all would really enjoy it because I found it on my iPhone earlier today and I was just like, oh man, I never really thought of posting that or I completely forgot that it was on my phone. So yeah, and forgive the camera angle. It was once again taken on my phone, not with this cool camera I have now. So yeah, it's just forgive the video quality. But anyway, it's meant for the laughs. So hope y'all enjoy. And one last thing, y'all, I just want to give a really quick shout out to my friend Laura, or as you may know her as Dallas Fangirl. That is her YouTube channel. Go check it out. Go subscribe because she's awesome and she also gives away really cool, awesome prizes. So, anyway, so yeah, she is the person that I still need to thank over and over again for this helping me find this awesome graphic novel. So yeah, just a quick shout out to her and Crystal Star, who I also met today for the first time in person. So yeah, I will probably be sharing um, a couple photos at the very end of this video that y'all can just look at ooh and all. So yeah, all right. Thank y'all so much for watching and I hope y'all enjoy the blooper video and the pictures. Hey guys, what's up? It's Reaper001 and I introduce you to ABP Dodgeball. Really epic fail, guys. Let's try that again. <laughs> Throw the damn spear, Joe. <laughs> Anyways, yes, it is. <laughs>